Hi, welcome to the virtual classroom. My name is Fahad Ali Khan. In this video, we'll talk about the matrix addition, subtraction and simplification. But before we proceed, we should have some clear idea about the order of matrix because it can only be done if we have, uh, if the matrices have the same order. Uh, now this can simply be checked by looking at the number of rows and columns in, in all the matrices. Like for example, if I am given with a column matrix, we write a matrix like this, I consider 2, 1, the two elements in a row. So I have two rows, the horizontal ones are the rows, the vertical ones are the columns. So I have two rows and one column. So the order becomes two by one as we consider the order of matrix as row by column. Similarly, if I consider a row matrix, maybe like two, one, then I have one row and I have two columns and the order becomes one by two. Now do remember that for matrix simplification, addition and subtraction, the two matrices must have the same order. For example, I consider uh, the first example. I'm looking to add 1, 2, 0, 1 with, uh, let's consider minus 1, 0, 2, 3. Now, when I'm looking to add two matrices, then do remember that identical uh, elements, I mean the position regarding their, uh, 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 their respective positions uh, in, in, in the particular matrices will be added only. What I mean to say that I'm supposed to be adding this one with this negative one, I'd be adding this two with this zero, I'd be adding this zero with this two, and one will be added in this three. So that's why we need to have identical matrices and then only we can add. So this becomes one add minus one, this is one minus one, two add zero, I'll write two add zero like this, zero add two, then one add three, and as a result, I get zero, two, two, four. Similarly, if I'm looking to subtract, if I'm looking to subtract, uh, maybe I consider like uh, another two matrices. For example, I've got uh, two, three, five, and one. And I'm subtracting another matrix uh, of same order, minus one, zero, two, minus one, then we'll do the subtraction the very same way. Elements of the same, element at the same uh, position will be subtracted, which means I would be subtracting minus one from this two, zero from this three, two from this five, and negative one from this positive one. So as a result, I get two minus minus one, I get two plus one, three minus zero, though it will remain same, but I'm writing it uh, 5 minus 2, I have 1 minus minus 1, that makes it 1 plus 1. So as a result, I get 2 add 1 is 3, 5 minus 2, I get 3 again, 3 minus 0, I get 3, 1 add 1, I get 2. So that's my final result. Similarly, if I'm looking forward to simplify, for example, if I'm looking to simplify, uh, I have a matrix like 2, that is to be multiplied with 1, minus 1, here we go, 2 into 1, minus 1, 2, 3, add 2, 1, 0, 1. Then first of all, we need to multiply this 2 with all the members. This number outside the matrix will be multiplied with all the numbers inside, all the members inside the matrix. So we get 2 into 1, 
2, 2 into minus 1, minus 2, 2 into 2, 4, 2 multiplied by 3, we get 6. When we add 2, 0, 1, 1, I'll go a bit directly. So the result is 2 add 2, I get 4, minus 2 add 1, I get minus 1, 4 add 0, I get 4, and 6 add 1, I get 7. That's how we are going to simplify it. So do remember all the rules. The basic rule uh, to simplify, to add, to subtract is to have the same order matrix. Then only we can simplify, we can add, and we can subtract. Thanks for watching. Keep watching my video and do share. Bye-bye.